Welcome to the Plowright Building. Today we're standing in the heart of the engineering of this facility. This is the HEPA deck or High Efficiency Particle Arrester Deck. It's one of the critical control systems that allows this building to function as a high containment laboratory. This building, is, its function is, of course, to do uh, great science. And the science that we do, of course, is about uh, high-risk pathogens. We work on pathogens that are important for the UK economy, but they also have implications for international uh, uh, economies as well. So we do work on exotic agents, exotic viruses, in fact. Increasingly, of course, we're working on pathogens that have a human uh, context about them, uh, zoonotic agents which can not only affect farm animals but also have the ability to pass on a disease to humans as well. So in order to be able to work on pathogens in this building we have to create a, a negative pressure regime in the laboratory spaces below. We don't want air blowing back out of the building which would then create a situation where pathogens were being released from the building. So it's, it's, it's highly designed to be a very specific directional airflow as you go from the outside to inside the building and the further you go inside the building, the greater the negative pressure will be. So outside is ambient, it's zero if you like, but as you enter into the building, it becomes minus 50 pascals. As you enter into more high risk spaces, it will become minus 150, minus 200, and we can then monitor that pressure almost on a per second basis in real time by our building management system. It constitutes about 50% of the cost of the building goes into this plant space. The investment that's been made in this building has been both from central government through, through BIS and through our, of course our strategic funder, BBSRC, and the investment is of the order of uh, uh, over £100 million has been put into this particular facility. It's taken a long time to actually come to fruition. In fact, it's been a, a nearly a 10-year process from the start of concept of design to the finished building that we see today. This particular facility is on an international scale the highest standard that you can attain. There are other facilities around the world which can handle, handle pathogens uh, of this standard, but this is the newest facility for the United Kingdom, and that's important for us in terms of our own capability, but also making sure that we have a facility that can handle viruses if they come along. 